In this video, I'm going to show you how you can fix problems with Google Chromecast freezing when you use the mirror option from the Chrome web browser. So a couple of weeks ago, I bought myself a brand new laptop. It was a high-end gaming laptop, but for some reason, when you open up the Google Chrome web browser and you click the cast icon to mirror the screen, it plays on your TV for around three, four, five seconds, and then it freezes, but the same keeps on playing. On my older kind of three, four-year-old laptop, this problem doesn't exist, it works perfectly fine. So I know it's not a problem with my Chromecast or my Wi-Fi, it's um, just the new laptop. So after some searching, it does appear to be quite a common problem, especially with new laptops or high-end gaming laptops. It's got something to do with the Intel Wi-Fi adapter. It's got a problem with it and it doesn't work properly with Chromecast. There may be an update um, in, in, in a, for the driver and so on in the near, fu in the near future. But for now, there is quite a simple walk around to get this, this problem fixed and working again. So this is just for Windows 10. If you're using um, Windows 8 or 7, the process will be similar, but I can guarantee how you do it. So, you know, just, just do this for Windows 10 and a Wi-Fi network. So I'm going to put all these details in the description box and all you literally have to do is copy and paste them and you should be good to go in, in the next five minutes or so. So the first thing we need to do is um, copy command prompt. And what we want to do is paste it into the search box on the bottom taskbar in the left hand side here. Just right click and paste. When this opens up, don't click on command prompt, click on run as administrator. Then a little black box will open up. And then the second line we need to do is this one here. So again, just copy and paste this from the description copy and then on this box here right click once that appears press enter on your keyboard so this is the important part so basically you can see on the left hand side here under MTU there's lots of different values most of these are set to 1500 what we want to do is increase the MTU on the Wi-Fi so the bytes in and bytes out and the interface so the interface is called Wi-Fi on my PC on yours it may be called something different if it's not called Wi-Fi you will need to copy this and enter it enter this into number three so you can see here where it says Wi-Fi here in the quotes if yours says something different here under the interface enter this details into here um, and then you should be good to go so mine's called Wi-Fi so it's entered here if yours is something else enter what it says so we need to increase this NTU from 1500 to something higher you can choose any number you like in my case, I'm just going to increase it from 1500 to 15,000. So you can see it here. I've entered 15,000. So again, I'm just going to copy this line. And I'm going to paste it. Press enter. And if it says OK, that should now be done. So you can close that box and open up your web, Chrome web browser and test it. I've tested this for several hours and it works perfectly fine. Hopefully it will for you, for you too. So basically, you know, that's how it's done. If you want to reverse it, follow the same process and just enter 1500 here again. And the values will be reset to the original settings. So that's how you do it. Thanks for watching.